everybody, it's Cookie Lou in Arizona. Just popping in to give you a quick update. Today is October 11th, and I had my appointment with my surgeon, Dr. Robert Blackstone, to discuss my weight loss progress and possibility of a revision. To a Dina Dina dual dino switch and I left here plenty of time because I knew there's going to be a lot of traffic and there was a ton of traffic and finally get down there it's quite a ways from here and um, find her her suite go in there get up to the reception desk parking was a bitch but <laughs> I finally found a parking garage and then uh, went up to the sixth floor, found his suite, went in there and went, Hi, I'm Lucille Surfy. I have an appointment with Dr. Black. So I said, Oh, yeah, Lucille, I just called you. I went, Uh oh. That sounds like bad news. Why would she call me to cancel the appointment? I couldn't believe it. She said, Dr. Blackstone had an emergency and she had to run to the hospital to perform emergency surgery. So she just left her a bit ago, and uh, very sorry about that. We have to cancel your appointment. We're going to um, try to reschedule, you know, soon. I said, how soon is soon? I waited four months to get, you know. I called her in June to make an appointment. Then I found out that I had to just go to the seminar first. That was in August, I think August 13th or something. Went to the seminar, and then after the seminar, they called me and made the appointment for October 11th. So that's another couple of months to wait. Four months. And uh, she said, yeah, people that are waiting six months to see her. Uh, we will get together, her and I, and we're going to reschedule. We'll call you in a couple of days, and hopefully we'll get you in you know, relatively soon. I said, well, I have another appointment next week on the 17th to see her dietitian and her nurse practitioner. I said, so if I don't see her, and I'm supposed to see the doctor first for you know, preliminary exam and consult. And she said, well, you could see them. You know, I mean, if we don't get you in to see Dr. Blackstone before the 17th, then most likely we won't because it's gonna be our last day here at this office. They're moving to a different location, which is just across the street. So uh, she says, but she says, keep the appointment for the 17th. You can see the dietitian and you can see Melissa, the nurse practitioner, and get all that other stuff done and get set up for some tests and um, get the uh, process going to notify the insurance for qualification, etc. So she says, but we will call you and we will reschedule. And we're very sorry, blah, blah, blah. So needless to say, I'm really disappointed today. You know, and I was driving home thinking, well, maybe I should check out another doctor or two. I mean, I should have done that all of these four months that I've been waiting. But no matter who you go to, you know, you have to wait and you have to get an appointment. And sometimes it takes weeks and weeks to get in because you're new, you're a new patient. So sometimes you figure, well, you have a decent doctor that you know has got a good reputation. Just stick with her and follow, follow uh, the... Uh, Follow the steps or whatever you have to take. So needless to say, no appointment. Got really disappointed about that. So I'm just hoping that they'll call me within a couple of days and uh, set me up for no later than maybe two weeks. <sighs> about my bathroom, uh, some of you must know on my Facebook page I had some ba uh, bathroom problems. I had water in the walls and I had to have the whole bathroom ripped apart. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty much halfway done the contractor still I'm still waiting on the contractor to fix the cabinet sink cabinet and I called him yesterday and I said it's like 12 days now with no sink no door on my bathroom no tile replacement on the bathroom uh, I've been very patient I said but you have until Wednesday Thursday the latest to get this job 100% finished. Or I'm gonna have to call the insurance company and find a, get another contractor. I said, I told him yesterday, so today I'm gonna have a doctor's appointment, I cannot come, which is another thing that screwed up because he could have come here today. He called me up yesterday. 
he must have got my message. He said, oh, this is Jason from Westmore Contracting. We're going to get your, your cabinet in tomorrow. I said, no, I left you a message. I'm not going to be here tomorrow. I have a doctor's appointment. But he said, how about Wednesday? I said, well, Wednesday, yes, do it Wednesday. So hopefully tomorrow they'll be here. I'll have my cabinet installed, my sink cabinet. I'll have the tile work done. The door will be back up on the bathroom. <laughs> and uh, I'll hang my towel rack back up most likely too. Okay, guys, hope you have a wonderful week. Just wanted to give you an update. Bye.